Hi, thanks for joining me again. I'm going to read a book from the Mooseling series called Footprints, and I really like Mooseling, so that's why I chose another Mooseling book. Um, this one, in this story, Mooseling is having trouble figuring something out until he finally asks for help. So we're going to see it's not always a bad thing to ask a question or ask for help when you're having trouble doing something on your own. Okay, let's get started. This is called Footprints. Mooseling saw something in the mud. What is that? asked Mooseling. Those are footprints, said Beaver. Our feet make footprints when we walk. The beaver made a new footprint in the mud. See, he said. The next day, Mooseling was out walking. He saw more footprints. I think Rabbit made those footprints, he said. I will follow them and see. He followed them. And there was Rabbit. Rabbit, said Mooseling. I found you. You did? asked Rabbit. Soon Moosling saw more footprints. I think Skunk made those, he said. I will follow them and see. He followed them. And there was Skunk. Skunk, I found you, said Moosling. I followed your footprints. Good for you, said Skunk. Next, Moosling followed some very little footprints. I found you, Mouse, said Moosling. Mouse was not happy. She was taking a bath. Moosling, please, she cried. Stop following us all the time. Sorry, said Moosling. Then Moosling forgot all about Mouse. He saw new footprints. They were not like any of the other footprints. He followed them up and down and this way and that way but he couldn't find the animal who had made them. Moosling saw Hoot up in a tree. Hoot, you are wise, said Moosling. Who made these footprints? Go look in the pond and you will see, said Hoot. Moosling ran to the pond and looked in. Oh, I made those footprints, Moosling said. Then he laughed and Hoot laughed too. The end. So Musling was chasing around his own footprints, but he couldn't figure out who they belonged to until Hoot helped him out. And he ran to the pond and looked in, and he saw his own reflection in there and realized, oh, those are my own footprints. Okay, I have a question for you. Remember, you can write the answer down or you can record yourself saying the answer, either way, um, but I would love to hear your answer. Okay, here is my question. It's okay to ask questions when we are having trouble figuring something out. We see an example of this in the story. Okay, so your answer is going to have two parts. First, describe the thing that Musling was having trouble figuring out. Next, Explain how Hoot helped Moosling find the answer. Okay, so there's two parts. First, you're going to explain what Moosling could not figure out, and then you're going to explain how Hoot helped Moosling to find the answer. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that story. It's a kind of silly one, um, but I really like Moosling. I think he's a great little moose. Thanks for joining me, and I will see you next time. Bye.